do, let's play the board game. Now you know how the board game works. We pick two, so two celebrities, both of who are boring. We compare them both, and then I get to choose who bores me the most. So, let's play. Tonight on the board game, who's more boring, Zoe Deschanel or Chloe Sevigny? Well, on the one hand, Zoe Deschanel is a, an actress, a model, singer, songwriter. Zoe's most well known for starring in the TV series New Girl, which uh, she won an Emmy for. I've never seen nor heard of that show. Uh, Zoe Deschanel plays the ukulele. She's allergic to soy, and she went to the same high school as Jake Gyllenhaal, whose name is as difficult to spell and pronounce as Zoe Deschanel. Zoe's favorite song is Journey's Don't Stop Believing. She's 39 years old, and she's currently on her third marriage, which might explain why her favorite song is Don't Stop Believing. Fairly uninteresting. Um, on the other hand, Chloe Sevigny is an actress, model, and fashion designer, aren't they all? And she's mostly known for her work in independent artsy films, which means you might be able to see her movies on Tuesday nights at the Alamo Draft House. Chloe Sevigny appeared in, in music videos for Sonic Youth, and Vogue magazine called her a fashion icon. Then again, Vogue also called the Macarena a good song. Chloe Sevigny starred, starred in the controversial film, The Brown Bunny, in which she allegedly made love on camera, yet the movie barely grossed $400,000. Ironically, everyone who saw the film found it to be super gross. It's a tough call, honestly, but if you had to pick who bores you the most, Zoe Deschanel or Chloe Sevigny, the correct answer is Zoe Deschanel. And thanks for playing the board game.